Good afternoon, everyone. I hope everybody is having a blessed day. So today is Thursday. Um, I'm in my home and Andrea and Christine, myself, have been working on some videos for everybody. Thank you so much for the emails that have poured in, the kind comments, and most of all, the unconditional, unwavering love that you are showing us in this time of need. We will be up, we will be open for business so fast and so ready to really do everything that we do even that much more better. So today is Thursday, it's the law of intention and desire. This is one of my favorite laws. I always look at myself as a manifester or a transformer. And that is really what this day is about, intention and desire. And I always like to look at it as you're planting seeds of intention, seeds of what you really want. And you begin to see with your attention as well as your ability to walk from what the intention was without hovering, but sending that nourishment and love, you see the fruits of your desire. So that's what it's all about. Often we have intentions and we ask for something, we want something, we desire it. And then when it comes by or when we are acquiring it, we, we've missed the boat. We don't even know that we actually manifested this. So that's not always a good thing. So you want to keep this energy going, but planting these seeds of intention, bearing the fruit of your desire. And remember, the fruit is always for the good and the well-being of everyone, for the whole. So let's just begin this short meditation. Bring yourself into this grounding a uh, place wherever it may be in your home or wherever you may be in this moment. It could be outside. Anyway, in this time, it's really important that we continue to put our seeds of intention out there. All our seeds must come from the heart, this heart-centered place of love. This is the bridge, the home of the soul. This is the ability to really get the transformation of that soul fire of the belly, that place of transformation and manifestation. It moves from that core of your being, the belly into the heart. Remember, these chakras really move and they, they're not separate from anything. You know, they're moving up the body and they're very much connected in the glow of one another. So, Let's just begin this intention and desire meditation by planting seeds. Think about what you really want. Think about what you desire. Think about what the world needs. Because if you need it, the world needs it. So let's just settle in, find that comfortable seat and close our eyes and just take a great big breath and exhale, letting it go. And let's take another big breath in. You want to work into those lower chambers of the lungs where all of that good immunity is and fresh blood. So breathe in, 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 and exhale, let it go. And we're going to do another breath where we breathe in. Three big breaths. We're going to suspend and hold the breath really creating that locked up bond that let's try this hold and suspend the breath and exhale let it go and again three breaths in hold and suspend that breath Letting it go. And once more, three big breaths in. 
holding, suspending, take it out of the chest and make sure it pushes down into those lower chambers. Relax your shoulders during the suspension. And exhale, let it go. Just be aware of your breath. As you settle in, closing your eyes. Just be aware of your body. Let go of any tension. Sink deeper to wherever you sit, allowing Mother Earth to cradle you. Relaxing the physical body, softening the eyes, the physical eyes. And take your gaze with your eyes closed into that third eye at the brow. So gaze with your closed eyes into that intuitive eye. And just be there for a moment as we begin. I'll direct you where to shift your gaze as we move through this intention and desire. So close your eyes, relax. Cast that gaze into that third eye, Ashna. Be aware of your breath. Asking some soul questions. Keeping that gaze to the third eye. Asha, what is it that I want? What do I truly want? What do I desire? What do I wish for others? What are my wishes? Mm -hmm. My wants. And mostly, what will be? Keeping that gaze to that beautiful indigo that third eye. Let's just release those questions to the universe. Our intuition knows. How to orchestrate the magic behind those wishes, those wants, and the will be. You can follow your breath, rise and fall of the chest. Stay in that gaze. Through your intuition, the expansion of Ajna, the third eye. You invoke an unbounded creativity. The unknowing is known through the wise eye you will see so much more so widen the lens here and see the world and see yourself with so much greater potential. Take a deep breath in. Keep focused on Ajna, let it go. (sighs) 
Let that intuition settle in and rest. And now let us begin collectively. Working on those seeds of intention bearing the fruits of our desire. So as we settle the mind, their gaze is still into the wise eye, the wisdom, the intuition. We begin to know unboundedly what it is that we wish for, what it is that we want for ourselves and others, and what will be done. So today, collectively, we will plant a seed together. The seed for peace, well-being, hope, and transformation of our current situation as a whole in this world. Collectively, our seeds are so much stronger. They will bear so much more fruit. Our wishes, our wants, yes, will be done. Shift your gaze from that intuitive eye into the heart, the green, Anahara, at the chest. This place of love, equanimity, peace, harmony. Let it emanate out, let it reach and stretch beautiful beams of green light. Know that we are going to wrap every seed, every intention with love with light as they begin to transform into light. Once you've secured those seeds and you wrap them in that place of love, knowing it is for the whole and the holiness of all. Let us drop them gently into that fertile field. Into that intention. As we press them in deep, collectively. Remembering it is in the dark of the seed in the soil that it begins to germinate. It begins to crack open and it finds its way into the light, reaching for the sun. Plant with love, deep in the dark. Know the transformation is the fire of light. Move to the center of your belly, the core of your being. Your soul fire. And know that your intention and your desires today collectively, they are supported by nature's intelligence. So plant, plant, 
Let the one see find its way up. And let it germinate again over and over with the wishes, the wants, and the will be done, creating a crop, a field infinite, filled, fulfilled with all those intentions of peace. of healing, of transformation, and of a complete homeostasis, state of being for our universe, our world. Feel this in the belly. Feel this warmth come over there lies no different than in nature. The green busting through the dirt, the earth, the little sprouts growing, bursting open, flowering, more and more wishes fulfilled. Gaze out into that field of beautiful yellow flowers. Everywhere. Each flower represents that intention. That desire, unbounded. Peace, well being, complete homeostasis in the world, in every cell of our being. Continue to visualize in the core of your being. This is your destiny in life. Manifestation, transformation. Thou shall be done. Look at fields and fields of the beautiful yellow flowers thick, healthy green stalks on them. The leaves, the earth, bearing these, knowing for the good of all, these grow. No different than our intentions and our desires. The transforming place of the sun within our belly, the core of our being, is the manifester, always. Today we planted seeds that not only bring us something, but these intentions give to the entire wholeness of our world, our universe, 
Breathe deep into that core, the sun in the center of the belly. And let it go. Move up into the heart, the green, the landscape of life, the home of the soul. Continue to bear love with every breath that you take in gratitude with the breath that you give back. Shift your gaze back into the third eye, Ajna. Wisdom and intuition. I want, I wish, I will manifest for the whole. Deepen the breath here, inhale and exhale. Now shall be done. Continue to nurture your wishes, your wants. It will be. Cast your seeds into the wind, bury them deep into the soil, and expect a crop. So that you can share all of the goodness and the grace with the world. Deepen the breath, keeping the gaze at the third eye, knowing unbounded. And release the breath. And now just shift your gaze into a quiet, neutral space with your eyes closed. Just visualize the color green. Visualize the color yellow. Visualize that field of flowers. Feel free to run through them. Feel free to dance all the way throughout them. Rejoice knowing your wishes are well on their way. Your wants are knocking at the door. It will Deepen the breath, inhale and exhale. Breathe in love, exhale gratitude. And when you're ready, 
Just begin to move the toes and the fingers. Coming back to this place. Let go of that breath. And keeping your eyes closed, just be aware of your body, your mind, and your spirit. Bring your hands to your heart. And let us give love, light, and life to all. Thumbs to the forehead and let us honor the wise eye. Hands back to the heart, let us honor the love that emanates out. And let us feel the core of our being, the sun and the warmth and the transformation. And let us manifest the wants, the wishes that will be. And when you're ready, Letting your eyes float open gently. Inhale, exhale. And I honor you. And I honor the light in you. For the light in you is the reason the light in me is so bright. We reflect this eternal flame of holiness. Namaste.